The Frog Prince, a tale of kindness and promises. Once upon a time, in a grand castle surrounded by lush gardens and deep forests, there lived a beautiful princess. She had sparkling blue eyes and golden hair, and she loved to play by the castle's enchanted well. This well was known for its magical properties, and many believed it could grant wishes. One sunny afternoon, the princess was playing with her favorite golden ball near the well. She tossed it high into the air, and as it came down, it slipped through her fingers and fell into the deep well. The princess leaned over the edge, peering into the dark water below, but she could not see her beloved ball. Oh no, she cried. What will I do without my golden ball? As she sat there weeping, a small voice croaked, Why are you crying, princess? The princess looked around, puzzled, until she saw a small green frog sitting on the edge of the well. A frog? she exclaimed. Did you just speak to me? Yes, the frog replied. I can help you retrieve your golden ball, but what will you give me in return? The princess, desperate to get her ball back, quickly promised. I will give you anything you want, dear frog. Just bring me back my golden ball. The frog looked at her with wise eyes and said, I do not want your riches or jewels. I want to be your friend. Let me live with you in the castle, eat from your plate, and sleep on your pillow. The princess, thinking the frog's request was silly, agreed. Yes, yes, I promise. Now please fetch my ball. The frog dived into the well, and moments later, he emerged with the golden ball. The princess was overjoyed and quickly took the ball, running back to the castle without another thought for the frog. The next day, as the princess was dining with her family, there was a gentle knock at the door. A servant opened it, and to everyone's surprise, the little frog hopped in. He looked up at the princess and said, Princess, you promised I could live with you in the castle. The princess felt a pang of guilt but didn't want to break her promise. She explained the situation to her father, the king, who said, A promise is a promise, my dear. You must honor it. Reluctantly, the princess allowed the frog to sit at the table and eat from her plate. That night, the frog followed her to her bedroom. Please let me sleep on your pillow, he croaked. Though she was hesitant, the princess remembered her promise and placed the frog gently on her pillow. To her surprise, he was warm and soft, and she soon fell asleep. The next morning, the princess woke to find not a frog, but a handsome prince lying on her pillow. She gasped in surprise, and the prince smiled at her. Thank you, dear princess, he said. I was cursed by a wicked witch to live as a frog until a kind princess let me share her life. Your kindness has broken the spell. The princess was overjoyed and introduced the prince to her family. The king and queen welcomed him with open arms, and the prince and princess soon became the best of friends. Over time, their friendship blossomed into love, and they were married in a grand celebration. The entire kingdom rejoiced, and they ruled together with wisdom and kindness. And so, the prince and princess lived happily ever after, 
Always remembering the power of a promise and the magic of kindness.